Hi friends, in this video I'm going to talk about a basic Java question. Can we use reflection? How can we use uh, reflection to call a Java method at runtime? Uh, in Java there are two ways where you can create an object and invoke a method. The first way is using new operator. Okay, so using new operator you can create an object and call the method. So this is my class, my message, and there is a public method called message display. So using new operator I can create an object and call this method so this is called static binding and now there is another way using Java reflection Java reflection is a very powerful feature to deal with Java class at runtime it can be used to load the Java class or call its method or you can also analyze the class at runtime okay so it's a very powerful feature now using Java reflection I'm going to call this method okay so using class dot for name, I'm going to load this class. So entire package detail I should give. So it will load the class and it will create an object. Then I have to give which method I want to trigger or invoke. So method name, then I'm going to call the method. So line number 20 is very, very important. That's where we are going to call that method. So I'm going to debug now. Already the class is loaded into the JVM. Now create an object, then get the method and line number 20 is very important I'm going to invoke the method using Java reflection okay so we called this method using reflection the normal method normal way of doing is using new operator but we have done using reflection hope this video is useful thank you